Joining me is uh, number 81 for LSU, Thaddeus Moss, who a uh, big game tonight, a number of catches, and this offense was clicking. I mean, over 500 yards against a pretty good defense. Yeah, I mean, this is a credit to the coaches. I thought we had a great game plan going into it. We had a great week of preparation, a great bye week uh, last week of preparation, and then we just executed the game plan. Nearly 200 yards rushed in the football. I mean, that's, a, that's been a problem for LSU against Alabama over the years, but when you're able to rush it like that, it really opens up, Joe, and opportunities for you. I mean, I thought the O-line played great. Lord Cushenberry, we, uh, he, he questioned the O-line, you know, and was questioning them to have them step up to the plate. Um, he put up a paper on every O-lineman's locker last Monday of just the stats from Bama last, last year. So, you know, he, he was challenging them, and, and they needed to step up to the plate, and they did tonight. I thought the, I thought the O-line blocked great, and I thought Clyde read the blocks, and I thought he had a hell of a game. Zero points at home offensively a year ago, 46 on the road in Tuscaloosa. I mean, that, that that's one of the more amazing turnarounds ever. Yeah. Um, I mean, just a credit to our coaching staff, a credit to our coaching staff, a credit to the players. Um, you know, we, we put in the work this offseason to shine like this, you know, tonight. You had an opportunity to play in some big games this year. I mean, at Texas at the time was a huge game. This atmosphere tonight, a couple Auburn, Florida. Uh, how, what was this like? This was different. Uh, you know, it was a battle. Like you said, we've been in four, you know, three or four other ones. Um, but this was different. Um, you know, it was a great experience. It was a great four-quarter game, and, you know, we just came out victorious. At the end there, when you guys know you're going to win it and you're just taking a knee, you know, try to express what that's like The the, the uh, at the end when you know there's nothing they can do. I mean, it's the best play in football, victory formation. Um, you know, there's no better play than that. Uh, but, I mean, it just feels good. It feels good. You're lined up out there. You know, we're all celebrating. We got smiles on their faces. Defense is just out there looking sad. Straight faces. They can't say nothing. Um, but it's the best play in football. It feels great whenever we go victory formation. Coach O was very emotional after the game, and he did his national interview on midfield. I mean, there were tears in his yeah. eyes. I mean, th 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 that tells you this one's not, not normal. Mm. No, there was almost tears in his eye when he was giving the pregame speech. Um, you could just feel you could feel his passion and his emotion. He knows how much this meant for, you know, the state of Louisiana, and you know, he cares so much from for he cares so much for the state of Louisiana. So, them tears are real tears. Um, you know, he had, like I said, he had tears in the pregame, and you know, this game just means a really lot, a, a lot to him. Lastly, did Joe Burrow lock up the Heisman tonight? <laughs> I think he did. I think he been had it locked up, but I think tonight is for sure, for sure locked in. Thaddeus Moss, ladies and gentlemen, let's go back to the studio.